What's up everyone, welcome back to my channel and in today's video I will be sharing the 10 best high ground retakes for beginners or simply if you're bad at building they'll be great for you. I personally use lots of these retakes so they're not outdated or anything so let's get on with the video. Before we start I would really appreciate it if you liked and subscribed with the notifications bell on if you enjoy my content or simply just find this video interesting and useful for you. A quick thing to say is that this video is divided into two parts and this is part one. Part two will be uploaded in a a few days. Let's get right on into the video. Right, so the first high gun retake is gonna be the protected ramp. I'm gonna explain these retakes throughout the video at 0.4 speed so that you understand it properly. First, what you wanna do is place a ramp just in front of you, then look to your right, put a wall, then it's important you look up very high or else this second wall won't go up, and then move back to the left. Again, you still need to be aiming upwards a lot or else if you see this wall right here is gonna be placed and you don't want to do that. You can do it if you want but I don't recommend you do so or to waste lots of mats. After placing this wall right here you just wanna place another ramp on top. For this you, you don't really need to look up anywhere, just straight at this wall and then edit this wall. You can do it both ways, it doesn't really matter, it's just how I like it. You need to be very careful when you want to place this second wall you need to be looking up quite high or else you'll miss this wall and it will end up looking like this. It's still effective but if for example you're trying to protect yourself from the opponent that's right here he's gonna have a free shot at you. So just try and do that. Right. You can also do it left like this. Once you get more advanced you can start playing around with it and here instead of just editing this wall right here and just going forward you can just edit here and sort of do like the same thing all the time. Right, so the second high ground retake I will be showing you today is simply just the Swifo Cone. I'm gonna explain it first at 4 speed like I did with the other thing. So you just going up like this and make your opponent right here and he's about to get a shot at you so you right here instead of you could also use the retake of before but you could also use this retake so right I'm right here instead of going forward you're gonna keep going forward with the ramps but you're gonna just place a, a, a wall here another wall here and another wall here and then a cone you can also place another wall here if you want, but I don't normally use that. Again, it would look like this. Like this. And this is what it would look like from the opponent's POV. As you can see it's just a cone on a wall really. Impossible to get shot. Because they first have to break these fields. After you've placed these two walls, because you need to place these walls first, or else you will only be able to place the cone right here. You just want to try and aim as high up as possible until it gets detected, or something like that, and it looks like this. And then you want to turn around. Yeah. Right. So the third high and retake I'll be showing you is the cone rush, how I like to call it. I don't really know if he has a name, just call it that. First you wanna place a ramp, just like this. Then place a wall or a cone first, whichever you prefer. I think it's better if you place the cone first. But right afterwards you place the ramp, and then you wanna drag the ramp here, and connect another ramp with your wall. You can keep going like this, and it's a really effective way to rush someone. You wanna place your wall, after you gone past this like part here or else you'll be placing the wall just here. So you place the wall right afterwards, you need to be on top of the second ramp. Also be really careful, you need to place this wall and ramp really quickly so that you don't fall here for example. See? I, I just keep falling. Now getting on with the 4th high gun retake I'll be showing you today. Once again, 0.4 speed. 
What do you want to do here? Just press a ramp, a cone, and you can either right from here place these two walls, or if you're very fast, I don't really recommend it, but you can just edit and place these walls really quickly, or else your phone is gonna break. After that, you can either go left, so straight basically, or when you're right here, edit to your right and repeat it again, just like this. And then you can just keep on going like this to another high ground retake and combine them. If I do like this and I don't place the walls yet, I let it and it's not fast enough, my whole ramp is gonna fall and you're just gonna fall down and die from fall damage probably. You can also do this retake to your left. If you keep doing it for some reason, it's sometimes very hard for you to place a ramp right here. If I jump already, like I can't place my ramp. Right, so now on to the fifth high ground retake. This is basically like the first retake, but instead of editing here or just going right, right here, you want to look up and place a cone right here. I don't know if you can see this guy. See, I placed a cone right there. After that, you want to place another one here. And from here, I personally like to do a double edit or a triple edit if you are able to do that. One thing you can't do is look up too high here. See, right now it's not placing if I'm looking up too high. You need to look just high enough so that it places right there. You see, if I'm too low, it won't place right there. And if I'm too high, it won't place right there either. Right now, as you're not very advanced, I recommend you just either do this high ground retake or place a ramp, floor, ramp. Just like this, and just let it out like that, which is pretty easy. You can add this extra wall if you want to, but it's not necessary. Right, so that's the end of the video. If you enjoyed the video, please smash that subscribe button with the notifications bell and the like button, and be sure to stay tuned for part 2 of this video. Peace out!